Hi everyone, Vindicator Jones here. As promised, here is my video comparing a stock Vulture to a fully engineered one. I won't ramble on too much today, but you can find the builds for the Vulture in the description below. I've also included some bonus footage of the Vulture using my favourite weapon, the Class 3 Plasma Accelerator, at the end of the video, so keep an eye out for that. Okay, let's not waste any more time, let's just jump straight into it. Okay, moving in onto this little eagle here. Here's some elites, but that should be okay. We go down relatively quickly. This is just more of a test run. Okay. Taking as much damage as I thought. I am using just pulse lasers though, I guess. I don't have any multi cannons. Of course, you could run with one beam and one multi cannon. That's an optional choice. Not my favorite kind of load out, but it's still an option. Come on. Die for me. Okay, that took a bit longer than I expected, but there we go. Okay, moving into this python here. Uh, it's a dangerous level. I've been having a hard time trying to find dangerous and deadly level pythons. Oh, sorry, chips. So, thanks for I found this guy. I initiated combat a little too far away. I should have got a lot closer. Now I'm going to have to resort to boosting and trying to get close again. I think this is not going to work for me. Yeah, I've sort of messed this up a bit. Just a quick note too. Um, I'm actually not going to use pips into shields. So we can basically get a good idea of how all the... Uh, well, how see the shields react to different builds while using the same settings. There's logic in there somewhere, Just let's just go with that shall we. Probably going to be a big mistake but um, let's see how we go. Yes because my shields are almost gone already. Okay I need to get a bit serious about this, I have to get a bit closer to him. Oh there goes my shields, not good. Okay this is where I want to be. Alright move into position now. Okay, hopefully we should be able to get him before he does anything silly and gets away from me. There's my power distributor. Come on. Okay. I should boost, but I'm not going to, he's going to die. Okay, well this is going to be interesting. Up against the Anaconda and I've only got 63% hull left. But that's okay. This is what this is all about. So. I've initiated combat in the right position. I think I should be able to stay here most of the time. And he's launched a fighter. Ah, this is not going to be good. I should put pips into shields, but I'm not going to. I'm going to stick to my initial premise of no pips into shields just to see how we go. If I can hold my position here. Oh, there's this fighter firing at me. Oh, he keeps dropping SCBs. This is going to take a while. Just stay with me, guys. Perhaps I can hold my position. Too bad here. Oh, he's boosting. I should boost too. Ah, this is a bad idea. It's okay. I think I can hold my position. Nah, I'm going to lose this in a second. I should have boosted with him. See, now he's turned on me. I knew that was going to happen. That's okay. Hopefully I should probably get back into position. He's dropping SCBs, charging up his shields. Oh, there he goes. My shields are gone. And I've only got 40% hull left. <laughs> this would be interesting. His shields. Come on. Drop. Okay. I've got his power plant selected. I don't think I'm going to survive this. It's a bit silly. Taking any bomb like this. Let's just see how we go. 90% hull to my 33% hull. Okay, I'm trying to get close to him from the side so he can't turn on me and get back into position. I'm sort of screwing it up here a bit. 
Let's see if I can just get the position a bit better. Nah, I'm sort of messing this up. I only got 30% hull left. And basically, a really crap distributor. Well, it's the stock distributor, so what do you expect? Oh no, he shoots back. Twenty-six percent. Surprised my cockpit glass hasn't gone yet. This isn't good. Really want to try to get close to him again. This is really not. Oh, this is a good idea of what not to do. Down to twenty percent. I mean, his health. I mean, his power plant's nearly down. That's good. Oh, this is good. This is where I want to be. This is perfect. Just get his power plant down. Might be able to pull this off. Just, come on, power distributor. Attack from the side there so I can pitch up to me. That's my cockpit, 7% hull. He's got 0% power plant. Ah, oh, that sucks. Okay, so he hasn't got a power plant, but he's able to continue fighting. Come on. I'm gonna die here. That, that's it for me. I'm gone. Okay, there, there was a lot of bad choices there, but that's okay. Let's keep moving. Let's swap over, shall we? Okay, let's see how this engineered baby takes down an eagle. Ooh, there's a big difference there. Pulse lasers. I'm running rapid fire pulse lasers, which I quite like. I actually have gone back to. Whoops, pay attention to what I'm doing there. Oh, it's so nice having a properly engineered power distributor again. There we go. Next, please. Okay, moving on to this clipper here. Get nice and close if I can. This will do. Oh, just look at that power distributor. Look at that. That's what I like. Look at those rapid fire pulses just going crazy. Also, have a bit more maneuverability thanks to the dirty drives with drag modification. Oh, just look, look at that. Look at my power distributor. Just, sorry, I know, it's getting a bit creepy. And there he goes. Huge difference. Huge difference. Okay, what should we get next? Checking one of my favorite chips, Fertilance. Try and stay nice and close to it. Whoops, I've completely overcompensated there and messed that up. But that's okay, we'll move back into position. Well, I'll try to. Oops. Uh, roll that off. Gotta get close again. A boost, just move in. Best I can. Oh, something else is attacking him too, which is handy, but not really what I want. So look at that power distributor go. Hey, you know what? People put rapid fire pulse lasers down. But I'm gonna have to say to you, I actually like them. I guess because also my playstyle it suits me because I like to get close. So I suppose if you're at dis uh, longer ranges, it makes more sense to have overcharged. Well, anyway, he went down quickly still. Oh, here we go. Didn't have much luck with the other anaconda, did I? But I've got a full hull this time. I've got rapid fire pulse lasers. I've got better shields, better armor. Definitely a better power distributor. And I completely messed this up a bit. Right, I'm gonna get close in again. Okay. 
Yeah, he's released a fighter too, but that's okay. I think I can take the damage. I'm just really just trying to push my way in. Ah, this isn't good. It's okay. I should put pips to shields, but I'm not going to. So I'm going to stick to my promise. Okay, this is good. See how it got in through to the side there and he wasn't able to pitch up? Ah, he's with me again. Chaff too. Shields are quite resilient. Okay, this is where I want to be. This is perfect. I just want to hold it. And I'm not going to. Should boost. Yep, we go. Oh, temperature's going up. Temperature's going right up. I'm just gonna keep going. Because my shields are about to drop. I'm all in. Stuff it. Let's go for it. Temperature's rising. I'm not, not going to back off. Let's see how well I can. Let's see how far I can go with this. Oh, distributor finally comped out. But only briefly. Oh, this, this power distributor, sorry, his power plant's gone. But he can still fight. Oh, come on, destroy. Destroy. There we go. Okay, I'm cooking, but that's okay. We killed the target. That's all that matters. Okay, I'm into my favorite build here two large plasma accelerators really not that's a close okay a little bit too close this is okay oops i was waiting for him to reload there come on there we go do quite a bit of damage I'm pretty efficient too which is really really important come on hold the position i wish other targets were fitting at it but that's okay this is just more a bit of fun <laughs> a bit too late for the shields there okay i've had to swap res sites and Found a nice little clipper here. Get nice up and close. A little bit more. Time to give you some cuddles. DJ style. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Damn it. used to these gonna get back into the swing there we go I do love cosmic accelerators so I think they're a very fun weapon to use and they really do teach you uh, fixed skills quite nicely Steve not doing much damage to me that's fine ah damn I thought that one's gonna hit this will. Go. Another one. Should do it. There we go. Very nice. Okay, Federal Assault Ship. It's very maneuverable little ships. Quite good little combat ships. Let's see how well we can do. Okay. I didn't realise he'd already taken a bit of damage, but that's okay. Try and stay close to him if I can. Yeah, that was just a shot to see if I could hit it, but I didn't. 
Anything go? Rude. And one hit. It's a nice little dog fight. Yes, your SCVs are no match for my plasma accelerators. Straight into your cargo hold. Sort of euphemism for something. Well, maybe a bit. Okay, led myself to get distracted there. That's okay, he's not gonna last much longer. I don't know who else is shooting at him though. One more shot. There we go. Very good. Okay, got another anaconda. Oh, I might as well finish off with an anaconda. It is an elite level one, and there are others firing at it, which kind of sucks, but I'm actually having a lot of trouble trying to find the dangerous and deadly targets. So this is just going to have to do. But you can see there the damage that happens. Trying to get in a bit closer. No, that was just too. Yep. One hit. Trying to do a bit of a flip. No, it's not going to work. That's why boosting isn't always your best option. Although it tends to be a tactic. A lot of people tend to spam, which is not necessarily all the best thing to do. Okay. But then again, sometimes it is. <laughs> there we go. Say so again, power plant zero. Hilarious. Pretty sure in the old days they used to come to a stop if the power plant went to zero. I mean, it's pretty logical to me. Anyway, he died. That's all that matters. Well, that was pretty interesting. Again, I think the big standout was the power distributor, and in this case, the power plant, as it allowed me to add more power hungry items such as shield boosters. But what do you think? Was there something else that really stood out to you? Also, what ship should I try next? Let me know in the comments section below. If I get enough requests for a certain ship, I will make a video of that. If you like this video or any of my other videos, please consider supporting me on Patreon. The more support I can get from you guys means more time I can take away from my day-to-day -day work and direct it towards making more content. If you can't, then supporting me by liking the video and subscribing would also be fantastic. Also, don't forget to add me on Twitter to keep up to date with what I'm doing and other silly shenanigans. This is Vindicator Jones signing off. Thanks for watching and I shall see you out there in the big black.